called Death by Burning. And uh, it just I was just thinking a lot about, you know, in, in the olden days when they used to burn people for being witches and they used to like they used to be like, oh that, she's got dodgy hair cut or whatever, or I saw her growing some plants. She must be a witch. Mm -hmm. And it just reminded me a lot about um, I suppose when the Me Too movement started and people was trying to find reasons to ignore women's voices. So kind of thought I would uh, write this. More people came to my execution than my trial. Filled the streets chanting, burner, burner. Cheered as you stood on your pedestal and announced my crimes. Pointed to the man that I bewitched. Your mouth was so full of Salem that there was no room for truth. Me, I was too full of nose. Turned down the devil's dinner invite too many times. But still you said you saw me there, feasting on apples. Too embarrassed to admit that your date never showed. In a society where men pass on blames like hand-me-downs, the stories never quite fit properly. But that doesn't matter. We wear hate. Use it to cover up imperfections. Hide worries heavier than any stack of Bibles. The most powerful magic is not found in tarot, nor by the fireside of bare-naked ladies, but in the words of people that dwell in ivory towers. Sacraments that live on tongues of those who only have to open their mouth to speak God, yet claim to be normal believers. Repeat she lies throughout generations, making it the world's oldest ritual. You tried to sink me into this river, yet I float. Thou shalt not be judged by law, but know that my body is my courtroom and all my evidence present. I am not unholy, I am just unholy. Prometheus, light the match, spark the resistance, let the smoke rise higher. Because when they burn me at the stake, I will learn to speak in fire. Thank wow. you.